Hey everyone, how are you? Hope you're doing really, really good. Welcome back to my channel. If we haven't met, hi, you can call me Tanan, and this is my channel. And today, as you can see in the title, we're doing the update for the Partners in Cream project. I've been working in this project for a really long time. I started this project in my Instagram account back in January, but I introduced it here on my YouTube channel on April. And I've been working so hard in some products, but today we're having a super exciting update. We are going to have plenty of rollouts and some roll-ins, so I'm super excited about that. I'm filming this update a little bit earlier because it's the 6th of the month and this video is going to be up on the 10th. But I don't think that I'm going to have much more change. In the next couple of days and today I'm liking my makeup so I decided to film. Hope that's okay for you. So if this is the first time that you're seeing this project, this project was created by Steph and Alin. I'll leave both her channels down in the description box but the whole idea of this project is to work in cream and liquid products so the only rule is that no powder products are allowed and I've been working in five products since the introduction and plenty of those products, I have had them here on this project since the introduction. So yeah, I'm ready to roll out some of those products. But as always, I'm going to start with the products that I have used the least, up to the products that I have used the most, and some of them are going to be rollouts, and I'm super excited about that. But yeah, don't want to make this introduction too long, so let's start with the first product. Okay, according to my notes, the product that I have used the least since the last update is my low-key uh, liquid lipstick from NYX. This product I have been working on since April. It's the one that I'm using today. And usually, like, for the longest time, I've been feeling like this product is just endless. Even if I have been using a lot of it, uh, usually, like, the want of the product is full of product <laughs> um but lately it's not like that i feel like soonish i will need to like take this stopper out and when i'm looking at it against the light i can see that there is not a lot of product left i'm super confident now that i'm going to be able to finish this one before the end of the year i wasn't as confident last month or a couple of months ago because as i said it usually feels endless but I don't know why suddenly I can see the light at the end of the tunnel. I'm not dying. That sounds like I'm dying, but I think you get my point. But yeah, I have been working super hard on this product. Most of the time I use it as a blush, not today. I haven't said it yet, but I have used this product 11 times uh, since the last update for a total of third, no, 49 uses. I'm happy about that because in the last couple of months I have only used it like three times each month so I had the goal to use it at least 10 times. I'll try to use it even a little bit more in the next month so maybe we're going to be able to finish it in a month or two but the finale is in two months so I'm nervous but this one is going to be done before the end of this project. I feel like I'm all over the place, so I'm so sorry about that. But let's move on to the next product. Sorry if I'm looking down. I have my notes over here. And here is a super excited, excited, exciting update. Because the next product that I have here is my foundation. This is my Maybelline Super Stay Full Covered Foundation in the shade Ivory. And this is basically gone. I have almost an empty here. When I'm trying to take product out of here, see, there's a little bit left in this packaging, but it's getting really, really hard to get the product out. So I'm going to call it an empty. I'll try to use it a couple more times in the next couple of days to see if I'm able to get any more products out of this uh, foundation. But I cannot believe that I finally finished this foundation. I've been working on it since the introduction, since April, but before then I was using it since January. And before even that, I tried to 
finish it last year i don't remember in which month i introduced this project this product to a project i think it was a project that i was doing on my instagram i'll leave the month when i start working on this foundation but it took me forever and i cannot be more happy about the finally finishing this foundation i'm not really good at using foundation usually i only use foundation a couple days a month because it's not something that i really enjoy but since i was trying to finish this foundation uh my usage in foundation has gotten much better and i use foundation almost every day that i do my makeup and i kind of like it so that's a change for me <laughs> but i cannot be more happy this is my first ever empty in a foundation i thought that i have more product on it but the pump is not getting the product anymore so i guess it's an empty as i said i'm going to try to use it a couple more times to see if i'm able to get a little bit more product out of it but this is an empty and i'm super happy okay moving on what do we have next the next thing that we have is my eyebrow pencil and it's looking like this i think i have sharpened it sharpen it sharpening it how do you say that like two or three times since the last update and i'll leave the picture over here of the paper that i'm trying uh, in which i'm tracking this pencil but we have a really good progress on it i'm confident that i'm going to be able to roll out this product and finish it before the end of the year and actually it's getting a little bit harder to sharpen this product so once i'm not able to sharpen this product i'm just going to call it an empty but i think it's going to last me at least a whole month more to finish it so that's good news this one should be done by next update or if it's not it's going to be in the finale can you believe that we only have one more update and then the finale i cannot believe that so i need to be very strategic about the products that i'm going to roll in but well moving on we have the primer the never ending primer and this primer i have used 25 times and i still have product on it but i can feel like it's almost empty like i only have a little bit more product over here and this is going to be definitely be gone by next update or at least i hope so i'm not going to roll this product out i'm going to keep working on it but i think i'm going to roll in another product on its place because i feel like pretty soon maybe in a week i'm going to be able to finish this one so i'm still going to be working on it i'm going to update you uh, for this product next update but i'm also going to roll in another product for this product Am I making any sense? I feel like I'm going to watch this video when I'm editing it and maybe I will need to refilm it. I hope I don't, but maybe I will. That leaves us with the last product and if you saw my last update from this project, you probably know which product it is, but that is my concealer and I kind of finished this one last update last update i mentioned that i wasn't able to get any more product with the one so i use a spatula to be able to remove the little bit left that i have from this product and put it in another container and i said that i was going to try to finish that little bit left before this update but to be honest i didn't do that because that product like the consistency changed it was like super thick and it wasn't like nice at all so i decided just to toss that away and this is an empty i use all the product out the only reason why i had that little bit more it was because i took the stopper out and used a spatula but i used the whole thing i got my money money values i never know how to say that and this is another rollout that i'm super excited about and we're going <laughs> and we're going to be rolling another product in its place 
So to wrap up today, we're going to be rolling out these two products and we're going to be rolling in another two products for these two. But also, even if this product, this primer is not empty yet, I'm going to roll in another one, another primer that I want to work on because I feel like pretty soon I'm going to be done with this product so first i'm going to be rolling in this primer over here this is from beauty creation the heat rating primer and i have this product since may of last year and i feel like i don't have a lot of product left and this is a concealer a concealer a primer that i've been really enjoying to use in conjunction of the other primer that i'm working on because this is a mattifying primer like with to smooth the skin and that kind of stuff while this one is more hydrating and since I've been working in this foundation and other foundations that are mattifying I feel like an hydrating primer is a nice product to use I don't think I'm going to be able to finish it in two months maybe I will be able I'm not sure but at least I want to give it a try try to finish it and see how far I'm able to go so yeah, this is the first product that we're going to be rolling in. Next we have the product that it's going to be replacing my concealer. And that is my eyeshadow base from NYX Cosmetics in Skin Tone. I got this product in May of 2019. It's getting a little bit old and it's not a product that I really, really liked. I may have used like a third or maybe no, a third between a third and a half of this product and um, I don't really like it I'm completely sure that I won't be able to finish this one before the end of the year and the end of this project there's no way but I want to give it a try before deciding if I want to declutter this product or keep using it next year and the last product that I'm going to be rolling into this project is this pencil. This is an eyeliner that I got um, in the first semester of 2019. So yeah, this is all. This is probably gross. I shouldn't have an eyeliner for this long, but look at it. It's super, super black. It's a really nice eyeliner. I don't remember the name of this eyeliner, but it's from W7. So yeah, I want to finish it. As you can see, it's a really, really small pen. I don't, it's smaller than my pinky, but I want to finish it. I think it might take me the whole two months to be able to do that. And I need to find a way to use it because as I said I'm not using pencil eyeliners but it's time to say goodbye to this product and since I'm not able to use toss it away and declutter it I want to finish it so I need to find a way to use it so yeah those are all the products that we're going to be rolling into this project and to be honest it was really hard for me to choose three more liquid or cream products to roll in into this project I don't have as many products now like in liquid and cream that I'm in a rush to finish. I feel like most of my older products are gone or in on its way to be gone in other projects. So yeah, that was hard and that makes me think that maybe I won't join this project next year. So who knows, I guess I'll just decide that at the end of the year or at the beginning of next year. But yeah, it was hard to choose the products for this update okay i think with all the rollouts and rollings this video was a little bit longer than what i prefer but i hope you enjoyed it i was super excited about this update because i feel like we got great progress on the products but i hope you enjoyed it if you like it please consider subscribing if you're doing this project please let me know how are you doing and i hope i'll see you in the next one bye